lifetime spent in the pursuit of knowledge, one question consumed me. How did our world come to be? Wait a minute, I just realized that's Zavala from Destiny. The old ones the hell? perished a thousand years ago. Okay. Triggering the extinction of all life. Yep, it did. She showed me how it was reborn. Mm -hmm. A little outcast girl, ignorant of her own importance. Through her, I learned that life was only saved through a technological miracle. Zero Dawn. <laughs> a terraforming system composed of nine subordinate functions. Mm -hmm. Each playing its part to reshape Earth from a barren rock to a lush landscape. Tended and protected by the machines. Terrifying machines. And with her, I learned Crazy the machines. deepest secret of them all. The secret of her birth. That she is a clone of Elizabeth Subek, Zero Dawn's creator. Hmm. Born to prevent a new extinction. It's been a few years since I played this. I don't remember everything word for word, but... Driven by Hades, a malevolent AI. Given sentience by a mysterious signal of unknown origin. And with a little help from me. She prevailed in a great battle at the city of Meridian. Becoming a champion for all humankind. But as useful as she has been, now I must leave her behind. For as she strives to put right what Hades sundered, I have made a new discovery. Oh boy. One that heralds both destruction and opportunity. Oh jeez. Like I said, it's been immense since I played this game, so now I 100% remember all the controls. Oh, and they look so cool. I forget what some of these creatures' names are. I'm never gonna have to remember that the hard way, I think. But the game looks great. I mean, it looks incredible. Like I said, the music is dope. I'm running out of time. There Wasn't she is, a hey. Aloy. Hey, land is dying. People are suffering. Soon, they'll starve. All because of a terraforming system that's spiraling out of control. And only I can fix it. <laughs> only I have your genetic code. It won't be long before we hit the point of no return. Aww. And then, extinction. I've been searching for months for what I need. A backup of Gaia, the AI you designed to control the system. Okay, that makes sense. It would make sense that she would have a backup. But every that time make I sense. think I have a lead, it comes to nothing. Hmm. Hold on just a second. Looks like it's a little... It could be a little too loud. I'm going to turn all the settings down just a little bit more. Just to be on the safe side. And every night, I have the same dream. I'm walking under a brilliant night sky, through a field of flowers. Okay. And when I arrive at the center, I see you, Elizabeth. Huh. Waiting for me, even though you've been dead for a thousand years. You're the closest person I've ever had to a mother. 
which is kind of odd considering that she's a clone. She's like the clone of you, or technically you're the clone for of a moment, her. I feel whole. Eh, whatever. But it never oh, lasts. that's kind of nice. Oh, now that's sad. Oh, Hades. I'm always left alone. Oh, I feel bad for her. This world is your legacy, Elizabeth. I won't let it slip away. Yeah, we better not. The valley below is my only remaining lead. My last hope to find the backup. I'll do whatever it takes to get it. I promise. Who the heck is this? Farl? <laughs> if it isn't Aloy, hmm. the savior of Meridian, anointed of the Nora. You know I hate being called that stuff. Well, <laughs> consider it a punishment for running out on us the very same night we beat Hades. I grew up an outcast. Remember, I'm not much for parties. Yeah. But that one was in your honor. Just saying. Yeah, he's got a point. So, what are we doing? Must be urgent since you left so fast. Delving into ancient ruins? Or maybe it has something to do with the blight. Both, actually, but, um, I should- Oh, no. I've been tracking you a long way. It's okay. After everything you've done to help the Nora and my family, I swore an oath to help you, no matter what. You're stuck with me now. Like bark on wood. Hmm. Never actually heard that analogy. I've heard, like... I've heard a couple different analogies, okay. like you're stuck with me, but I've never but heard the bark on wood one. That's a new one. Me, well, that's actually pretty cool. I'll need to be able to see what I see. <sighs> a focus. Never thought I'd get your second sight. Hmm. I'll give you another one later and show you how to back up your data. Data? Information <laughs> on the device. We've got a lot to cover. Um, I'll have to explain everything as we go. <laughs> you see like this all the time? Since I was a little girl. Come on. I remember the first time I remember actually us using the focus. It's very... It tricked me out a little bit because I was like, man, we're seeing all this like hologram shit in a world where it's supposed to... And that's what I think is so interesting about this game. It's like, okay, we use primitive stuff like bows and slingshots to beat gigantic monster you know machines it's like what are we doing all right i got a couple of scrapes on the way here we should find some medicinal plants stock up so it's time for your first lesson with the focus sounds good let's get started all right let's do it these plants don't look like the ones in the sacred lands. The focus helps you see the ones we need. Fair enough. Yep, the medicinal ones are good for health, Ugh. obviously. Yeah, well, at least they make you feel better. All right, we should keep going. Might want to grab more of these plants along the way. Yeah, good idea. No blight. It's everywhere. 
those ruins. That's where we need to go. Oh, what's down there? Search ancient valuables box. Ooh, could be some good stuff for later on. I will take it. And I just realized I'm also running out of air. Find anything good down there? A few supplies. What are we after exactly? The box. Salvaging machine carcasses as usual. And there they go. Looks like they left a carcass behind. I will say, this game, just to start, looks fantastic. A lot of arrows in that machine. Better take a closer look. Yeah, I'm a little Seems far away. Who else would come here? I don't know. We better craft some arrows of our own. There might be trouble up ahead. Good thing we already picked up some Ridgewood. Alright. Now to craft some arrows. Uh L1 Oh yeah, the weapon wheel. Right. Done. Me too. Arrows ready. I always did like about this game was where it's like, you know, I do like games where we have to literally crap There's all the resources as we go along. But can't reach it from here. Nothing a well placed arrow can't knock free. Just have to target the lock. For you going up by the goddess what was this I don't know we need to find a way in so um what happened after I left Meridian well, there was a fuss when people realized you were gone. But then some of us figured you only would have left if it were for something important. You were right about that. Mm. Dead end, Aloy. Gotta be around here somewhere. Down this way. Ooh. Wait, those are new? I thought we faced them in the last game. Those dead machines have it on alert. How do you want to handle it? The focus can help us. We can scan the machine before we make our move. Okay. Give it a second. Okay. See how parts of it are glowing? Those are its weak spots. Got it. I'm ready. Okay, concentrate. Another one's coming. How does the focus know all that? It reads data on the machine. Like a hunter studying its brain? Yeah, kind of.
So, after the fuss over me leaving, what did everyone else do? Well, as soon as the celebration was over, my mother led the rest of the Nora home. Got it. I set out to find you. You said you had a focus since you were a child, right? Yeah. Found my first one when I fell into a ruin. Got the others from an old cache not long ago. It's good to have extras. Hmm. Fair enough. Welcome to the Far Zenith launch facility. Far Zenith? I, I know they made some tech trades with Zero Dawn, but why would they have a backup of Gaia? Please register with reception for the tour. I guess they want us to check in with them. I should be able to pry this open. Sweet. There's climbing gear. Guess someone dropped in from above. Whoever left this here might have also shot those machines we found earlier. So where are they now? Good question. Very good question. Ugh, what's that stench? Entire camp wiped out. Jeez. They must have come here to Dell for scrap. Acid. That explains the smell. Yeah, it would. And it looks like something big came in from above. Crashed right through the camp. The wall. I should take a look at the rubble in that gap. Whatever came through here brought this down as it went out. If I can dislodge some of the debris, we might be able to squeeze through. Maybe I can find something to help in the camp. Aloy, over here. I think I got something. It's some kind of Osram prototype, I think. This hook looks like it can latch onto things. I must gear pulls it back. Hmm. It looks broken, but maybe we can repair it. Hook it to the debris. And pull it out. That could work. The focus can help us search the camp and identify anything we can use to fix the tool. My focus picked up a couple of things to check out. Poor guy. Acid burned right through his armor. Jeez. Part of a machine could help fix the gears. Machine cable. Stronger than rope. All right, I think I have what I need to repair the tool. Or maybe even make something better. You could use this workbench. Full caster, an improved version of a deliver's prototype tool that can latch onto objects and pull. Also enables grappling to specific points. Sweet. There. Uh, pull caster. Now to test it on the debris. Perfect. That works better than I thought. Well, it doesn't look like there's an easy way out of here. I should scan the area. We have to find a way to keep going. Huh. 
What's this thing for? Whoa. Good morning. I'm Oswald Dalgard, and it is my pleasure to introduce you to Far Zenith. Forget what you think you know about us. Hmm. Our truth is simple. We say reach for the stars, even if you have to cross 8.6 light years of space to get there. Please proceed into the auditorium, where we'll unveil our plans. Things didn't turn up much. I better scan. Wonder what's in this oh, auditorium. I might be able to get up there. Guess we'll find out. Oh, that's dope. Wow. That works. That pole caster is useful. Too bad there's only one. Don't worry. I'll find you another way up. Okay, I gotta drop the ladder for Varl. Well, that didn't do anything. There you go, Varl. Thanks. The pole caster can't reach from here. I'll have to get closer. I think I can use the pole caster on it. Hmm. Oh wait, can I like latch on? Let's see, can I latch on to the actual? Oh, I can pull the supplies. That's dope. That is very a nice little extra to be able to do with this thing. Okay, that's dope. That's a nice extra feature that you can use this thing for. Again, just cannot get over how good this game looks. Jeez, that guy freaks me out. We have always pushed the boundary as explorers, pioneers, trailblazers. And now Far Zenith is taking the next leap into the future. That's why we're proud to have resurrected the Odyssey. When our government's abandoned in orbit, Far Zenith will actualize in less than a decade. But that's only the beginning. When the ship is complete, we will send the Odyssey and her crew where no one's gone before. Whoa. <laughs> humanity's first off-world colony. The Odyssey may take 300 years to reach it, but when we look up at the night sky, we'll know they're on their way. This dude is literally and like the Eon Musk of, of the Horizon world. <laughs> what the hell? The form of immortality is data corrupt. The playback stopped. The old ones could fly through the sky? Between the stars? Uh, well, yes, sort of. That ship, the Odyssey, it, it never made it to the other star. Something went wrong, and it blew up. Dang. Well, that sucks. Again, I apologize if there are moments throughout the game where I don't 100% remember everything, because I don't. Error. Public presentation file corrupted. Member recruitment file available. Do you wish to reactivate? Yeah, reactivate. Let's see what else they had to say. Yeah, fair enough.
We all know the projections. Economic instability, new biocontagions, rampant AIs. How long before another catastrophe creates unacceptable risk for the world's elite? We here at Far Zenith believe, escape the inevitable. And so we reach for the stars. Now you've seen what we're building here. Infrastructure to support the Odyssey's construction. A state-of-the-art right. data center to facilitate rapid technological advancements. And you've seen how we're managing public perception. So okay. invest and join us. Claim your birth on the Odyssey. Preserve your way of life beyond the concerns of Earth. Well, they were right about the world ending. I just didn't know how yet. So everything yeah, they said back there about the next step for humanity, it was all a lie. These people only cared about saving their own skin. Yeah, well, didn't work out for them in the end. That Oswald guy mentioned a data center. There, the backup. It should be stored in there. Won't be able to swim across. I guess we'll have to find a way around. Come on. The wilds have really blown over this place. What the hell? What is that? I don't think I'm kill those officer. Keep your guard up. Oh, well, my guard is up. Yeah, same here. That was creepy as Light shit. Up here. That was creepy as shit. Ah, great more of those things. Careful. Don't want those things to call in some friends from underground. You take the left one. I'll deal with the one on the right. Okay. I need to sneak up on it to take it out with my spear. Can't let it see me. I should scan it first. Check its patrol path. Sneak up and strike. Just have to wait for the right moment. Time to throw. Spear strike. Come on, get close enough. Gotcha. Mine's down too. <laughs> More of those machines ahead. Nothing you and I can't handle.
Come on. There we go. Get a little closer. Come on. Aren't you curious? I've got your back. Getting many resources I can possibly can. Got them all. I've been meaning to mention. I noticed you have a new look these days <laughs> yeah I know didn't have a lot of time to shave when I was trying to catch up to you don't worry it's not permanent good <laughs> sorry my whiskers offend you anointed looks like this little guy got caught up in the blight I couldn't escape I hope it didn't suffer long The Osram must have used explosives against the machines. They managed to get a couple. <laughs> oh, <laughs> through the doorway. Looks like there was a barricade here. The machines must have broken through. I'll keep this for later. Guess that Osram didn't have a chance to use it. Careful. Traps ahead. Huh. Might be able to disarm them. There. Managed to salvage some supplies. And not blow Just yourself up. it. And got more supplies. <laughs> Looks like another camp. While we're here, maybe we can make some traps of our own. Might come in handy against machines. Good idea. I can use this. Oh, I don't have the right supplies to craft a trap. But it looks like the Osram shot off some machine parts. I might be able to scrounge up enough materials from them. Okay. I should have what I need to craft a trap. Oh, that's nice. That's nice that yeah. they do that. Explosive trap made. That's a. If anything walks into one of those, it won't know what hit it. I'll say this: I'm glad that they did that little extra feature. The having to go to your specific over crafting here, menu anyway. over and over again. Yeah, that's just annoying. Almost seemed machines ahead. Don't think they spotted us. I better scan them. This machine before. A scrounger. It's new to me. Let's see where its weak points are. Maybe we could place one of those traps you made in its path. Nah, I think I got it fine We're with clear. that. Let's keep going then.
been in a lot of old world ruins. Are they all like this? Whoa. That machine we saw earlier must be on the move. Let's hope it doesn't come this way. Agreed, let's hope. Storm picking up out there. Yeah. And they're getting stronger. And more frequent. So the storms, the blighted lands, the rivers and lakes choked with algae. You were born to fix all that? Yeah. But I can only do it if I find that backup. I think we're winding our way around to the data center. We'll need to cut through that big building on the right out there. Mm. This data mentions the tech that flies in here? traded with zero. Gold. Aloy, come check this out. It doesn't explain how they got it back up. I'll keep an eye out for more data. Looks like we've got Let's to climb see. up. Huh. A lot of glyphs. I'll tuck this away to study later. <laughs> oh boy. Well, it is a thousand years old. Oh shoot. You okay? Yeah. Guess we won't be going that way. That looks like the way we came. And indeed it is. Terraforming system, the brainchild of Dr. Elizabeth Sobek. Mm -hmm. Empowered by nine subordinate functions, Gaia, the core of the system, is capable of advanced planetary engineering, an obvious advantage to our space colonization efforts. Operation Phase One Establish an asset within Project Zero Dawn. Status complete. Phase two, okay. the asset will secretly beam cast a complete copy of Gaia and her subordinate functions to this facility's data center. If all goes well, Zero Dawn staff will remain completely unaware of the transmission. Risks. Discovery of this operation could result in Zero Dawn withholding the already negotiated Apollo database. Special care must be taken not to alert Travis Tate, the expert hacker in charge of Hades protocol. In addition... Uh -huh. Extreme caution must be exercised in regards to Dr. Sobek herself. As one of the world's preeminent technologists, she may have instituted unforeseen security measures. A complete assessment is attached. This concludes the executive summary. I thought Elizabeth sent the backup here, but she didn't. Far Zenith stole Gaia. Aloy? Why does that woman look like you? Oh, um, boy. It's okay, Prawl. We look alike because we're the exact same. Genetically identical. But she was one of the old ones. How can you be her? <laughs> because I wasn't born. I was made. By a machine. It's why I'm motherless, why I was cast out as an infant. Damn. I understand. What kind of machine can make a person? Remember when I said the backup is like a set of instructions? It's more than that. It's called Gaia. And for a long time, she cared for the world until she had to destroy herself. So she made me to bring her back. I'm the only one who can. 
And this place is my last hope. You once said the goddess spoke to you when you went into All Mother Mountain. Was that this Gaia? Yes, but she's not the goddess, Oral. There isn't one. How can you be sure? It sounds like she anointed you with a sacred task. <sighs> Jeez. I've got a lot of time to figure this out. And you will too, with the focus. But for now, the report said they were going to store the stolen copy of Gaia in the data center. So that's where we have to go. Okay? Man, I can only imagine what that guy must be feeling like having to absorb all this at once. Huh. Look at that. Aloy, over here. I found something you could use. A weapon. Thanks, Val. We should keep moving. After you. All right, the frost blast lane. Uh, blast lanes launch bombs that affect large areas. This weapon fires frost bombs. Use them against enemies to build up the frost or the brittle state. When in the brittle state, enemies are more vulnerable to impact damage. Okay, that's pretty cool. Down here. I think we're almost back outside. Good. Oh. That must be the machine. Jeez, that's a big boy right there. Great. Those machines. I could try with a new weapon on it. Machine must have attacked as they tried to escape. They didn't stand a chance. So, you said this backup is the last hope. Yeah. Those places I've been these last few months. There were supposed to be more backups. But a thousand years ago, a guy named Ted Farrow purged them all. Was he part of Far Venus too? No. He was worse. We can tag them in the focus to keep track of them.
Not exactly my idea, but... some climbing I can't believe the tutorial basically for the game has taken secret. almost like Sona was really okay with you not going back to the sacred almost place. like an as hour war chief she understood why I was obligated to follow you but as my mother she wasn't pleased is she ever pleased I don't think I've seen her smile me neither Oh jeez, let me guess boss battle. Three of those things. And if they slaughtered all those Osirum, we'll never get through to the data center. There's no way to slip past them. They're too tough to fight head on. We could find a settlement. Convince some hunters to help us. That would take weeks, and we don't have that kind of time. Maybe all we need is that shuttle to fall. That thing? How? We'll figure it out. Just wait here. Aloy? Trust me. And there she goes. <laughs> Just... I always did love the rappel down animation. I should be able to find a way across to the shuttle. Wasn't exactly my plan, but worked nonetheless. <laughs> It if I launch myself off that crappy point. Didn't make it. I gotta try again. Oh, I did not mean to drop that far. Holy crap. I didn't get up high enough. I better try this again. Get it from a better vantage point. I can reach the rail up there if I launch myself off the grapple point. Got it. Ah, that's what I had to do. Gotcha. That makes sense.
Ah. Well, that sounds good. Oh god. Okay, uh didn't mean for that to happen. How do I die? how do I die during the tutorial? Oh god, tell me it didn't put me back too far. Okay, good. The storm's getting better. So long, there were three giant machines killing Osiro and leaving acid everywhere. <sighs> Great. Damn. Looks like they're out of range of my focus. Tower down. On to the next. I won't be able to make that jump. And here's where it snaps, right? I knew it. Well, where to go up? This place is barely holding together. Looks like there are massive clamps holding the shuttle in place. I'll bet there's a control console nearby. If I can release the clamps, the shuttle should fall right into the basin. Oh, great. More machines in my way. Control console might be in there. Okay, time to crush those machines down below. Let's do it. Oh, great. Oh. That's so anticlimactic. Literally, those two cables are only the thing. Or four, I should say. The shuttle's caught up in those cables. I'm gonna have to climb the tower to find a way to disconnect them. Of course I am. Now, how to get out of the tower? Oh, God. Scanning with my focus could help here. Pull that beam down, it might drop the access lift.
closer to the shuttle to detach the cables. Hey, didn't mean to drive that far. for fuck's sake before I even get up there. Jeez. Oh my god, are you kidding me? It was over here. Maybe it was just a little bit. Almost there. There's the other connector. Down goes the shuttle. Um. Oh boy. Oh shit, yeah, no, that's not good. a little too close for comfort. Uh, yeah, of course one of them wouldn't be dead. At least I got it with a critical strike. Wait, what's it doing? 
Oh no, of course it now freed itself. Why not? Damn it, it broke free! I gotta take this thing down fast! That may be lost ammo. Well, my focus might find something I can use around here. And the big guy goes down. It's dead. Finally. Yeah, no kidding. Ah, oh, skill points, max health, nice. Holy crud. These are all the different sk skill tiers and stuff? That's a lot of skills. Uh, let's see which one I like the most. Uh, oh, gotta get to sur- Oh, I can only do certain stuff. Okay. Uh, let's see. Pork boost, passive boost, quick trapper. Place traps faster on the field. Okay, not bad. Uh, survivor, medical berries prove, provide more healing and heal you faster. Uh, infiltrator, stealth strikes deal more damage, which that could be nice. Um... Machine Master, Mounted Defense. Take less damage while mounting. Uh, Alright, I got the Trapper. Uh, Warrior, uh, that's not unlocked yet. And Hunter, increase your con concentration limit. Prolonging the use. Oh, that's not bad, actually. What the hell? Wow, that is really cool. <laughs> The data center should be straight ahead. I guess Varl's gonna have to find another way there. What the heck is this thing? Oh, I wanted to... Oh, these things can drop like blasters? That's sick. I wonder if it would have dropped them during the fight. That would have been cool to have to use. Oh well. Once I get the backup, I can reboot Gaia, fix the system, heal the blight, restore Elizabeth's dream. But is it still there? Okay, I should find the server room. And of course it's not gonna be. That'll make the game way too easy. It's here. Oh, I actually thought it wasn't going to be. This dude is literally such a douchebag. With a mighty hand, I smite and pour troubles upon you. 
See, he literally snap, like, crack his back one doing that. This ain't no copy of guy you stole, you losers. But it's the mother of all logic bombs. So good luck repairing your data. And next time you start thinking you can outsmart a tape, remember my salute. Go screw yourself, dude. Aloy? The goddess. There is no goddess. I told you that already. That's not Gaia. That's not what I'm looking for. It's nothing but a fake. Man, she is pissed. I think I would be too if I had gone through all that trouble for nothing. I got it. For a I'm sorry. You have a sharp bite sometimes, you know. But it was pretty amazing to see you fly off that tower and blow up the entire basin. The thing is, um, there's going to be more of that. I'm out of leads, Farrell. But I, I have to keep searching. And fast, and whatever risks I have to take, I will. And it doesn't make sense to have someone with me. Someone who might get hurt. This is on me, Farrell. Nobody else. Hold on. Before, in Meridian, you said there was a man who helped you. Silence. You said you used to talk to him a lot about things you discovered from the old world, things no one else understands. And he gave you the lance you used to defeat Hades. He's gone, Varl. I haven't heard from him since the battle against Hades. Sure, but Spymaster Murad back in Meridian, he's good at finding people, isn't he? Varl, I... <sighs> Come on, it might work. Plus, you'll get to see some friendly faces again. <laughs> okay. I... I guess it's worth a shot. We've got a long walk ahead. Actually... I've got a better idea. Nice. Oh, <laughs> you can definitely tell he's not used to that. <laughs> 